Hi, I'm Carl Hose with the Lincoln Electric Welding School in Cleveland, Ohio. I'd like to welcome you to the Welders Workshop. We're going to talk today a little bit about weld cracking and the causes of weld cracks and maybe what we can do to prevent that from happening. Uh, one of the common causes of weld cracking could be an undersized weld. A weld size, the size of the weld, um, is important and must be based on the thickness of the material you're working on. Thicker materials require a bigger weld. Uh, another problem could be the concave weld, um, the shape of the bead. If the weld is concave or hollow, it's going to have a tendency to crack through the middle. A weld should be flat to slightly convex or humped up in the middle, and that would prevent uh, cracking or could prevent cracking. Uh, another problem is the width to depth ratio in a weld. The width of the weld should always be slightly wider than the weld is deep, and that will prevent cracking that way. Another common reason for welds cracking is hard to weld steels. And I'm sure you've had that happen to you where a weld pulls right out of the plate or cracks next to the plate. And we're going to talk about that in another segment. Welding is safe when you follow the safety rules. Go to LincolnElectric.com, click on safety, read the safety articles, and there's some documents to read too. Read the E205 safety bulletin, the ANSI Z49.1 safety in welding and cutting, and your material safety data sheets. Also go to the American Welding Society website, aws.org, and read the articles in there. Remember, always read and follow warning labels.